So on my Linux Mint machine here, I have three drives. I have one that is my 250 gigabyte uh, main, main drive, which has my operating system. And then I have two internal drives that are both 8 terabyte. One of them is my storage, and then I have one that's backup of my storage. So these are identical. Uh, now, I need both of these to actually mount on startup because I have software that likes to run uh, without me having to do anything. For instance, my automatic backup software, and uh, when I open up my password manager, I don't want to have to actually mount these beforehand. Now, if I just click on one of these, of course, it'll mount it, but I don't want to have to do that. I want both of these drives to mount automatically on startup. Now, I've seen a couple videos on YouTube, and what these people do is they actually create a folder in their media folder they, they create a mount point here so they create folders and then what they do is they get the UUID number they go into their root and they edit their FSTAB and in there they put the UI, UUID number and they mount it that way now these videos are, are like seven eight minutes long now that's a fine way to do it you can certainly do it that way but I'm going to show you a much quicker way to automatically mount these drives. So as you can see on my desktop, both of these are already mounted. So if I go down here to disks, and you'll notice that I have these three drives, my main 250 gig, and then I have these two eight terabyte drives. Now this one here is called storage, this one is backup. So if I want to automatically mount one of these, I just click on the, I highlight the drive, I click on the gears here, and go to edit mount options and then I want to turn off where it says user session defaults turn that off and make sure that this is clicked on mount at system startup now my mount point is going to be in the mount folder MNT and this is going to be the folder name so I'm going to go ahead and change this to storage and then identify as I'm going to drop this down here and identify it as its label storage and then click OK. It's going to ask me for my password there and then I do the same with the second one here which is backup click on the gears edit mount options turn that off and I'm going to call this one backup and then identify it as the label backup and I'm done so now when I boot my system, they're going to automatically mount. Okay, so my system is rebooted, and you'll notice that both of those drives have been mounted. So if I go to my um, file system here and my MNT folder, you'll notice that both of them are mounted right here.